live the life of a fisherman, it never gets old. So welcome to the show, come on yo, we're going Ike. Hey everybody, Mike Iconelli here. I want to talk to you about cold water wintertime fishing. I want to talk to you about some of the secret baits and secret techniques that I've used to catch a lot of fish and some big fish under those conditions. I want a tight wobble crankbait. And the Rapala Shad Wrap has become a killer for me over the years. And I use all the sizes. But I want to modify this bait out of the box to make it a neutral buoyancy, suspending type, or flow, slow rise bait. That's really key in that cold water period. And on the number five or number seven shad wrap, you can make those baits suspend real easy out of the pack, simply by upsizing the hooks one size. So on a number five shad wrap, from the six size hook, go to a five. On the number seven shad wrap, go from the size four hook, up to a three. It's a real easy modification. But on these bigger shad wraps, and this is a key deal, the number eights and number nines, you could throw these on casting equipment, they dive deeper. There's another modification I make on these baits, and it's a really secret deal. I upsize the hooks just like I did on the smaller sizes, and I want to go one hook size up from the factory hook size. But the second modification to make this bigger bait, and remember, these are balsa, so they're super buoyant. To make these baits suspend, you actually have to weight the bait. And it's a real simple process of drilling the bait and adding weight. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use an eighth inch drill bit. I'm going to drill a pilot hole dead in the middle between the front hook hanger and where the lip comes into the body. And I'm going to drill that hole about an eighth of an inch deep. And then I'm going to get a regular tungsten long drop shot weight, a cylinder style drop shot weight. VMC makes one. There's a lot of different tungsten drop shot weights. And I'm going to use a nipper and I'm going to nip that tungsten down into smaller pieces. And I'm going to fill that hole with the tungsten drop shot weight. All I'm going to do is I do this inside. I get a bowl of water and I'm going to keep weighting that bait, keep adding weight until I get that bait to suspend in that water column. The last thing I do, once I find that perfect weight with that tungsten weight cut down, I'll get some silicone sealant, I'll pop it over that hole, and now I've got a big shad wrap, a number eight or a number nine, that suspends neutrally or rises really slow in that cold water. I gotta tell you, if you fish in cold water conditions and you like to crank, try a shad wrap, Modify it with bigger hooks or bigger hooks and weight it in the throat and you're going to catch some big, big fish in cold water conditions. When I fish like him, you know I'm fishing hard. You might want to say that I'm going like...